I got a quick message for you guys. Don't skip the ads. <laughs> going to be like the media room is to have it be able to be open but I don't want to have to see a TV when like I'm hosting people or just when I walk into my house I love the idea of not seeing a TV that not being the main focus and also when I have company here a lot of times that I've seen is you know the TV would be on because we're trying to entertain the kids or something while the adults are there and then everybody's kind of their direct their um, attention is directed towards the TV when it's on it I think it just happens everybody does that um, so my idea was to have the TV on the wall right over here right there so you wouldn't be able to see it out there so anyway, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to have the, uh, <laughs> one of the guys that's watching me tell him not to watch me. Okay, so anyway, we're going to be having um, doors going out right here. Come on. You're not in it. Bring it, bring it back. Right there. That's going to be the door right there. Right there, tell them about the door, right there. Door, right here. Double doors. Those doors are gonna be swinging outward too. Right, Brad? Yes. Yeah. Are they gonna be able to go all the way to the uh, wall? It's gonna be, a, it's gonna come out a little bit here. <laughs> it's gonna open this way. <laughs> Give Alan some air time. Salud a tu gente allá. <laughs> what do you want to say? <laughs> okay, so right here. They, they got to swing out. No. No, 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 no. They got to come out. I wouldn't be able to open it out this way. That makes the most sense because this has the most space sense? right here. Okay. And I want it to be. How does that make the most sense? Because think about it, when the door opens that way, it would be up against that wall and it would kind of make sense to me in my head. So when you, you turn it, if you go in, you'll actually cover the slightly. Yeah, not good. It's okay. Believe me, I know what I'm doing. She's a designer, she'll get it. If it comes out, it's not gonna wanna, it's not gonna be able to sit flush all the way, is it? So. Let's get into how things are going here at home. As you can see, I've got, you know, mess going on. Here's my setup right now. My daughter left this for me here in case I wanted some chocolate. But I'm just, I just got done making my video for uh, my planner video. So I'm happy to finally actually put something out today. Um, I did have an extra video go out yesterday with um, our reasons why and that was a little, you know, just a last minute deal that we did and we had so much fun just sitting there creating that video together and sometimes that's just what it's about is kind of documenting how you're feeling in the moment and poor Jorge, he is, his back is really killing him right now and um, I don't know if he's going to be able to finish this week out. I think he might end up taking a day off because how bad his back is, but we'll have to see. So anyway, yeah, my home is a disaster. Yeah, cat, it's a disaster right now. 
my mind is going in so many different directions. I have some collaborations coming up that I really have to focus on and get busy with working on. I wanna get these done before I have to uh, move. So there are two, two specific collaborations that I gotta get done before I move. And then after that, I don't know what it's gonna be like, you guys, because Jorge took up all of the tile, all of it. We're not gonna have flooring for a while. Um, we wanna wait, obviously, till after the place is painted, but then even after that, we're gonna be doing flooring after we're moved in there. I know that for sure. So anyway, I just thought I would jump on here and add all of this in there. The doors are going to open in. I did it too. And I'm putting my desk right here in the middle, looking out the window so I can so I can see that way and this way. This is going to be the um, what is this? The water heater room, little mini storage and water heater area. You did a really good job.
And we're back. Welcome to Inspired by Nikki on today's episode. Keep them right here up. We stopped late. Oh. We stopped late. We stopped late. Okay. I work out. I'm off. Hey, I'm off. Hey, come over here. Come here, good. Hey. You guys see Lion King? Okay, more Pumba. Take you through, show you what is up right now, and then next week I'll show you more progress. So here's a little tour. for the painters coming tomorrow. All the stuff I'm gonna have to tell them to do because I'm gonna have to be here earlier. So. That's loud. We're in the entertainment room. Show me right here. Okay, Show entertainment. Right here, right here. we're gonna gonna win many of battle royales. Go on! Oh, I can't get up. I have a come here, stop. Where's your cane? Yeah. Does this boy look like me? No. It's a, my surprise, are you filming me or am I filming you and your reaction? I guess here, you stop right there. Back up. <laughs> Back up a little bit. Stay there. Okay. Go inside, Aria. And don't say anything. Is that the exchange? That's the exchange for him going fishing with me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. Wait, wait. Stop right there. Stand over it's, here, it's Aria. Okay, come on in. That's how we do what it. Made you want to do that? 18. That I do it all for you. Thank you. <laughs> it was it was Brad's idea, but I executed it. Wow. <laughs> yeah, you killed it. That makes a big difference. Alright. Go inside look from the other direction and see even like this is big. Oh yeah. Nice. That's good. Oh, very open. Alright, so I just got back from my mom's, which is now going to be our place, and <laughs> Jorge, what is he showing me? Okay, so we have a ring doorbell, and Jorge just sent me what I look like going into the house because there were bugs outside. Whew. 
Okay, so anyway, I just got back from being it over there. So I saw that they opened up that space, which completely changes everything. And that was the one space that we were going to wait on to open up for like when we were going to redo the kitchen area. But now that's done. So I'm just so excited because I love just how open that makes it feel. And um, yeah, so I'm happy with where we're at right now even though we're not as far along as we thought we would be by this point but i'm still just happy with um the decisions we've made about things and you know that things are progressing um jorge's been getting a lot of help from his friends and it's just been really great so we're so thankful for all that they have done to help us with this because I mean, there's no way that we would be anywhere near where we are right now it, without all of them. So, yes, I'm very thankful for that. Um, the painters come tomorrow morning. I have to be there at like 8.15, 8.30 and let them know what all we're going to be doing. They're going to be scraping off the popcorn ceilings. They're going to be, um, you know, patching the drywall and taping it off and all of that stuff. So... That is what tomorrow is. I look forward to sharing all of that and everything else that, you know, for an, a whole nother week in next week's vlog for the Fixer Upper. So look forward to that. And I hope that you all enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. And until next time, I hope that you all take care and have a lovely day. Bye, everyone. right now. Kind of like tilt your head a little. Yeah, right there. Mm. Right there. No, wait. No. Are you kidding me? You can do it like that. No. That's a good thumbnail. How do you know? <laughs>